Hi, it's Modi, and we are about to have the most amazing day here at the mayor's house. A wonderful New Yorker who honors his Jewish heritage and loves his city, and he entertains and inspires through his works. He's a renaissance man, he does it all. He's an actor, he's a comedian, and at the same time, he's a cantor at the East Village's community synagogue. I, Bill de Blasio, of mayor, as mayor of New York City, do hereby proclaim Tuesday, June 26th, 2018, in the city of New York as Mordecai Modi Rosenfeld Day. Congratulations. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a miraculous day, not because I'm the one being honored, but because the mayor's voice was supposed to only last for one minute. But we got eight minutes out of him. And councilman and mayor talking about bombs and shelters, and that's the best thing before a comedian comes on. I want to thank you both. But that's what it is when you perform for Jewish organizations or Jewish comedy or Jewish... There's always some kind of a depressing thing before you go on. Always. Oh, my God, Mayor, you can't even imagine. I follow movies for diseases, for shelter. No, they bring a movie on where they got a guy. I lost my sight. They took my toes off. There's a machine on my pancreas. And some woman comes on, and here's Modi. I performed at the Holocaust Museum. They brought me on after a woman that they honored. They said, she'll be bringing you on. They're honoring her. And I thought she was going to just say, thank you. Bring me. She spoke for 48 minutes about what she went through in World War II. She finishes off with, and from the time we were in hiding to my, see my grandchildren now, I know I have won the war. And here's Modi. This is the city. This is, New York is it. Come on, this is, there's no other city in the world especially if you're an actor and a comedian. A few weeks ago, I shot an episode for HBO's Crashing. I walked out of my apartment, went a few blocks, and I was on the set of the movie. Where else can you do that? And we have comedy clubs in this city that are unbelievable. My home club, the comedy cellars here, where I perform all the time. What is the, the secret to perform for the Jewish community? The first one, of course, is you gotta keep it clean. They always say you gotta keep it clean, and then they give you the disclaimer, not for me. <laughs> you gotta keep it clean, not for me. I wanna see your regular act, as if my regular act had a pole and two dancers. I performed at a Shaver Brachus in the middle of Borough Park. And Mayor, if you don't know what that is, you're a very lucky man. <laughs> the woman that hired me was not only wearing a wig, she was wearing a helmet. Her husband, a nine-foot chassid with the white socks and a spudik, that's the strimal that's on steroids. And they said to me, you gotta keep it clean. Not for us. We're not that religious. It's the in-laws, they're from Lakewood. Those of you who don't know, there's a Jewish ambulance corps and, and the reason we have one is because nobody else wants to pick us up. We have to thank God for making this day possible. I want to thank God even more because I get to, uh, to be uh, a nachas to my parents that are both here, Bakhtia and Vitsalo Rosenfeld. Whatever we do as a community, we're not just doing it for the Jews, we're doing it for the entire community, which is one of the biggest lessons of the Lubavitcher Rebbe of sacred righteous memory. Again, thank you very, very much for this honor. Thank you. What a day. The mayor said it's Modi's day, and this proves it. I thank you all for watching. Thank you for being fans, and thanks for being a part of Modi's day.